Hi, I'm Ron Pars from Parpools.com, and we're going to continue looking at the six keys to good spa and hot tub water care. And the second key is filtration. Filtration means you need to filter everything out of the spa water. And you want to filter everything out because there's a lot of stuff that just gets in there, whether it's off of your body or from the environment. Especially if your spa or hot tub happens to be outside, which many of them are, you can have leaves getting in there, there's dirt that gets blown in and dust, bugs, all that kind of stuff, and your filter helps to remove most of that. Filtration is also necessary because when you have bathers in there, you are sloughing off dead skin cells. There may be you know, bits of hair or, or hair follicles that come off. All of that needs to get filtered. Keep in mind that when, you're, when your spa is running, it is not being filtered all the time. In fact, when your high-speed jets are on, there's almost no filtration going on. Because you need to have so much water going through, through the system at that point, a lot of the water is actually bypassing the filters, and it's going directly into the pump and back into the pool, into the spa, through all of the jets. So it's only when your jets are on low speed is when you're actually getting good filtration. Now, when it comes to spas and hot tubs, 99% of spas and hot tubs use a cartridge filter. They don't use sand, they don't use diatomaceous earth. And this is a typical uh, spa cartridge. Uh, this one has roughly 50 square feet of filter area, so if you took this whole thing apart and spread it out, this would be about 25 to, to 30 feet long and all of that is filter area. And it is pleated, so all the stuff comes in and is trapped. As a, as a, as a care note, uh, your, your filter should be taken out and hosed down, rinsed down, maybe once every one to two weeks, depending on what the usage happens to be like. This particular cartridge is what we call an open-ended spa, uh, spa cartridge, because it has two open ends. Your spa may have a different type of cartridge in it. It may have a closed end with an open bottom, or it may have a closed end with threads on the bottom so that it will screw itself into place, and that's held in place. Those are the, those are the main kinds of spa cartridges. Again, we, we were talking about cleaning them. Every one to two weeks, do a simple rinse to rinse off any excess or heavy dirt, debris, excess skin cells, that type of thing. But one thing that you need to do is, about every six to eight weeks, you need to chemically clean the filter. And by chemically cleaning the filter, what we mean is using a good spa filter cartridge cleaner. What we don't want you to do is put it into the dishwasher. What we don't want you to do is use a harsh acid to clean it. Both of those can actually set some of the oils and greases into the spa cartridge. Dishwashing, what that will do is, because of the, of the high jet action, that can break down and, and shorten the life of your, of your cartridge. So we don't want to do it that way. With a good filter cleaner, simply spray it on or let it soak overnight. That's going to dissolve and break up the greases and oils that have accumulated on the spa cartridge. After it has uh, soaked or it has been sprayed and, be and left to stay on, you simply rinse it off. You can rinse it with a hose or you can use a great tool like a, a filter flosser. As you can see, this is curved and that gets right in between all those pleats and does a, does a terrific cleaning job. That's filtration. Filtration is the second key to good spa and hot tub care. Do this, keep it clean, enjoy your spa. For any further information, you can, you can visit our website at parpools.com forward slash six spa keys, or you can email me at techhelp at parpools.com. In the meanwhile, enjoy your spa. Thanks for watching.